to Stouffer, new tonight, a Georgia State law student who helped prove a man innocent of a crime is now the victim of one herself. You're looking at the vigil held today to remember Alex Pistafio. Pistafio died, Pistafio died in a wreck last week, and today police told Channel 2 it was actually a wrong way crash that killed the woman. Channel 2 investigative reporter Mark Winnie is live in Northeast Atlanta. Mark, you just did a story on Pistafio last month. Yeah. Yeah, we understand that this double fatal accident uh, happened on the Buford Highway connector. But weeks earlier, I was blessed to meet Alex Patafio at a law office where she worked while a law student who helped change a man's life. You know, we're very happy that justice was served today. That was Alex Patafio after we met her. Her boss, defense attorney Manny Aurora, suggests she was starting her law career off the right way that he believes work she and fellow third-year Georgia State University law student Robert Wilson did played a major role leading to the DeKalb District Attorney's Office decision to drop armed robbery charges against Arthur Manning early last month. Now the Atlanta Police Department says Alex Patafio died in a collision with a wrong-way driver Friday night on the Buford Highway connector. She was just coming back after having dinner with her parents in Roswell and was just driving home to her place in Midtown when the accident happened. Aurora says working as law clerks in his office, Wilson and Ms. Patafio pieced together phone records that corroborated what Manning had told police from early on about his whereabouts, far from the scene of the crime, and confirmed them with alibi witnesses on a case the office had taken on without charge only three weeks earlier. Here is um, the cell phone tower that his cell phone was pinging off of. I've been innocent the whole time. I didn't know anything about an armed robbery. There was a lot to dig through. Um, a ton of, of data. I was extremely impressed by their professionalism, their ethics, and their specifically their work ethic. DeKalb Superior Court Judge Shandina Morris says on the day it concluded, she commended Wilson and Ms. Patafio in court for their crucial work on the Manning case. Arthur Manning's life will forever be changed. And so I was just very heartbroken to hear about the tragedy over this weekend. And so she will be missed in our profession. A crowd gathered at the Georgia State University Law School for a ceremony honoring a law student who left a life-changing legal legacy while still a student. She is the best of who we are. I think anybody who knows Alex would just say that she is just like a bright star and she just had a spirit that was contagious and she was always fired up about something, some sort of injustice, and I think um, she was just like a firecracker, for lack of a better word. She was this close to, uh, to really being able to make an impact on the world. And for someone with her charisma and courage and boldness, that would have been an enormous impact. Now, APD indicates the wrong way driver died also. Uh, the cab DA's office says in the final days of the Manning case, that office basically collaborated with the defense for the right result. That today, a statement from D.A. Sherry Boston says of Ms. Patafio, we appreciate her passion and commitment to the pursuit of justice and pray that her work and impact serve as an inspiration to other aspiring attorneys. And I seem to remember Ms. Patafio being especially complimentary of Robert Wilson's work with her on this case. Reporting live, Mark Winnie, Channel 2 Action News.